What's up guys? Uh, in my last video, someone asked me a question. Is it okay to leave my iPhone charging overnight? So I thought I should make a small short video on that topic. But before I do that, I, you know, I want you to understand what, <clears throat> how to calculate a battery cycle, you know. So one full charge cycle is charging from zero to hundred percent or any combination that adds up to hundred percent, such as 50% to hundred percent twice or 30% to 55% four times, etc. I know it's a little bit complicated math, but if you think about it, you will understand. So now also I want to clear one myth and some people say, if you charge your phone to only 80%, you know, this one is at 54% right now. So some people say if you charge only up to 80% and then use it and drain the battery down to, let's say, 10% and then charge it to 80%. So that will uh, help you to make the battery, keep the battery health better as compared to, you know, drain it all the way down to 0%, which is never recommended, but you know, it will it will last longer. Yes, this is because the battery finds it easier to charge when it is slightly empty rather than nearly full. And therefore it has less stress within its, its charging cycle. Yes, it makes a little difference, but you cannot say that you can uh, uh, make the battery life like twice as much, but no, that's not going to happen. Now let's come to the main topic. Is it okay to leave my phone iPhone charging overnight. Like this phone is on charging for a while. You know, I have a few older models here as well. Now you can charge your iPhone every night, even if the battery isn't fully drained. So like, you know, you keep using the iPhone and it still it stays on charging. That's, that's you know, it, it's, it does not affect the battery health of, of an iPhone. Now iPhone has built-in feature, it automatically stops charging when the battery is full. So it has built-in feature, you know, that's that's um, for the safety reason as well. So it, it shuts off charging while uh, when the battery is full. So it's safe to keep your iPhone connected to a charger overnight, you know, due to that feature. Now charging resumes automatically once the battery level drops down a bit and it starts charging again. So I should, you know, I thought I should make a video, a small video to clear that myth that charging to 80% will not increase your battery health and leaving the phone or ch charging overnight is not going to kill your iPhone battery. I hope that clears the question. And thank you for watching. See you in next video.